this is my bookshelf and there's also some drawers at the bottom at the top i have all of my trophies and medals from gymnastics and vietnamese school and the first two shelves i have my books which are organized in a very compact way then i have some miscellaneous things and some more makeup product type things in there let's start with these first two shelves here I've got all of my books. If you want me to do like an in-depth tour of all the books that I have, then I can do that. But we have a little sunflower here in the corner that I got from volunteering with the World's Greatest Shade. And then I have some Rainbow Rao books because they're really colourful at the front. I've got a card with Cinderella on it and Vampire Academy Shadow Kiss. We've got some... Twilight books at the back, some vampire books, Vampire Academy. We've got all of Rochelle Mead's Bloodline series here. It's kind of organized in a weird fashion. I've got all the Harry Potter books. It's lined vertically and horizontally so I could fit the most amount of books in this space. And then I have some on display. Over here we've got little Elsa and Anna as little soft toys and another Elsa from Tokyo that my cousin gave me. Then on the second shelf going down we've got more books. So we've got Vampire Academy, Beauty and the Beast, like fairy tale collection, Jacqueline Wilson, which is one of my favourite childhood books. We've got Lolita, got all of Sarah J. Mass's books stacked like that. So I kind of like to keep the series stacked together, unless they didn't fit, <laughs> then I kind of separated them. We've got some Cassandra Clare back here we've got some of my sum sums or sum sums i don't really know how to pronounce it we've got chip baymax olaf bambi piglet tigger stitch and i've got a little poodle captain america doctor strange which are two of my favorite marvel characters i also really like iron man but i don't have his little sum so that's a bit sad <laughs> On these two shelves, I have a bunch of miscellaneous things. So I've got a really pretty mirrored jewelry box with some little flower prints on it. And it just has a drawer here. We've got some jewelry and then it opens up like that. And we've got some more jewelry. But this is kind of like my fake jewelry that I don't really care much about. So that's why it's out there in the open. We've got my Calvin Klein cologne which is beautiful. We've got a little Dale, I think this is. It's either Chip or Dale, and it's a really cute, like, little mini poof. <laughs> we've got some more songs. We've got Simba, Timon and Pumba, and we've got Buzz Lightyear. I've got a NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream little mini collection, a Burberry perfume, which is also very nice and I use that on special occasions and I've got the box for that here as well I've got a moisturizer, a candle, Vogue Sunnies which look like this <laughs> I've got a glass house candle, another little mini candle that my friend gave me for my birthday an Ikea candle that I have yet to burn because I literally don't have a lighter in my house. And I have this little mini tea, English breakfast tea, little Peter Rabbit thing that I got in London when I was on exchange there. So that's kind of like miscellaneous things. It's not really perfect, but it's kind of just for display, I guess. I kind of don't love this last shelf, but it is what it is. <laughs> Over here at the bottom, I have a bunch of beauty products. So it just has my everyday makeup that I use on a more day-to-day -day basis, even though I don't really use makeup every day, but I just use this stuff most often, so that's why I have the top. I have got James Charles palette. I actually haven't had the chance to use this yet, but it is super gorgeous. It has some beautiful colors that I got for my birthday from my wonderful co-workers. We've got a box of face masks at the back here. And then in the first drawer, we have some face products, 
eye products, palettes, and lip products. I actually don't have that much makeup, but if you guys want me to do like another video on my makeup collection, then I can do that. It hasn't really changed much since the last time I've done a makeup collection, so it might not be that interesting, but let me know if you guys want to see that. Here I've got a little mini thing of my nail stuff. I've got my makeup brushes. So I've got like smaller ones, fatter ones, Mario Badescu facial spray. In this little tray, which is how I've kind of organized the bottom, even though it looks really busy, it is as organized as it can be. I've got some body sprays, some perfumes in here. So I've got my YSL perfume, a perfume that I got from Paris. I've also in here got some nail polish, you can see there. I've also got this plastic cover for this bookshelf so that I don't ruin the furniture. In this little jar, it has some beautiful flowers in it. It's just got some sharpeners for my eyeliners. And then I've got a brush cleaner, some acetone, which is almost running out. And I've also got a Lush shower scrub magic crystals that I will use. And I got that for my birthday from my coworkers as well, which is really, really nice of them. The next thing I have here is something really important that you need during quarantine. It is Glen 20, some disinfectant spray. Need a lot of this actually because it can never be too safe with sanitizing things. I've got two mirrors here. So I've got like just a rectangle one and then a cow one. Here I've got a basket which actually has two stacked on top but I don't need to use both of them so I've just stacked that on top. I've got two Lush hot oil treatments that I have yet to use. I've got some Dettol hand sanitizer some AeroGuard and just like a bunch of random things. I've got like face masks, more hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. Got some Tiger Balm, which is a Asian staple. Some lashes, Lush lip scrub. And yeah, it's just like a random assortment of mini products. And lastly, in this big drawer at the bottom, I have a bunch of things. So it's just really random things. I've got like a laptop case. I've got some whiteboard markers, some notebooks, adapters, bin liners, which is actually really useful. Some cards that people have given me. And this box has arts and crafts in it. So it has paint brushes, stickers, paint, all that good stuff is in there. And that is basically my bookshelf.